A life influenced by tragedy, Sherry Delalo has used her painful memories to make a difference in the world by working to address issues around health equity. Inspired as a youth by the passing of her three-year-old sister, Sherry has spent the last 22 years working hard to improve Indigenous health care by building partnerships between remote communities and the health care system. Just to see the health disparities within the community where I came from and the struggles that Indigenous people were having, um, it became a passion of mine. Originally from a remote community in northern Saskatchewan, today we find Sherry working in Edmonton at the Stollery Children's Hospital, where she serves as the Indigenous Child Nurse Coordinator, a role that supports physicians, staff, patients and families between home, hospital and community. Our program, the Awasasik Indigenous Health Program, and my role is to support that family, to help them feel welcomed into the hospital, to show them around. They're from a small community and they've never been in a big hospital. And there's a lot of fear associated with that, a lot of doubt, a lot of shyness. And so our program is there to help them feel safe, to show them around, to give them the emotional support and the spiritual support that they need to feel comfortable within the hospital. For Sherry, being able to assist families going through the challenges of having a sick child is one of the most rewarding parts of her job. As an Indigenous person, she uses her culture and experiences to help those in need of support, whether they're the family she sees through the Owasasic Indigenous Health Program or any other person facing challenging times. On this day, Sherry helped guide two young brothers through a traditional smudge cleansing the soul of any negativity and praying for their father who was in surgery. For us to walk into that TP yesterday and see those two boys in there, that's part of that whole process, that whole belief that God puts people in our lives as teachers and as providers to serve. And for those two boys to be there, their father's in surgery. And the older boy was trying to teach his younger brother about what is the TP, what is Indigenous health. And for us to actually walk in there and provide a smudge, it was a highlight for him to experience and to share with his younger brother. And his younger brother understood it right away. There was no judgment there. There was no hesitation. He just did it on the faith that we were doing something to support his dad and to pray for his dad that he'll come through surgery. Having published articles and developed multiple programs around Indigenous health, Sherry has become a wealth of knowledge that healthcare organizations go to when they need information or a different perspective. This unique view on culture and healthcare is just one of the reasons she was invited to join the RPAP Board of Directors in 2018 as a representative for the College and Association of Registered Nurses of Alberta. I feel quite honoured to be on the board. Coming where I came from and having the opportunity to represent registered nurses is a huge honor for me. The board is amazing. They're so welcoming and supportive of me being there. I feel very valued. I feel like I'm an expert. Like they see me as an expert and that means a lot to me. Having lived in both small and large communities, she knows the benefits and challenges that can come with both. But for Sherry and her family, rural is the best place they could be. When we moved to Mellet, we fell in love with the place right away because it's beautiful here. We heard the schools were amazing. And that's what the kind of environment I wanted to bring my son up in. It's just so peaceful and joyful and it, it slows down our lives to enjoy who we are and what we are. According to Sherry, Working in rural communities also allows health practitioners to know their patients better and to be given the opportunity to see the true outcome of their work. Relationships are so important in my personal life and in my professional life. And here we, we are able to build those true friendships and be connected to community and serve our community and see the results of our service. 